there come a time, uh, Carly, where you became aware uh, that there were uh, uh, people who believed that Sandy Hook was a hoax? Yes. And can you tell us your first recollection of, of about when you became aware of this? Um, within the first couple months, it started people posting the picture that you just saw alongside of other pictures of young women crying um, from anywhere from the Boston bombing to Aurora, other, um, other tragedies. And my picture was put alongside of them saying this is the same crisis actor. She's everywhere. How can she be in multiple places at once? And from there, it just felt like it snowballed. It just got worse. When you say uh, there are people everywhere and the snowball got worse, in what way were you made aware of this? And Objection. Call for speculation. Well, how did, you, how did you get exposed to all this? I mean, you know how you got exposed. Friends of mine would send me articles. Um, other people would tag me in the post. So I would look on social media and um, I would have on Twitter and on Facebook and Instagram, there were posts that were just made and it would be people arguing back and forth and I would finally get tagged in to the conversation. And I just remember that I had no idea why somebody would make this up. I was so confused. When you say tagged, I mean, you. You'll have to excuse some of our non-Facebook. Is it Facebook that tells um, people or something? Instagram and Twitter. Oh, okay. Um, so what is tagging? Um, somebody like comments your name on a post, and then that way you're able to see what the post is. Um, and without being tagged, you would never know the post was there.